All right, so first off, I always start off with the shape here. I think it's in a trapeze family of shapes. Uh, it's not more narrow at the top and then wider at the bottom. So this is the overall body shape. Next, we're gonna draw the arm. It's like another trapeze inside this one. And that's like one, two, three, three quarters of the original shape. So next to draw the arm, we're just gonna make sure the line aligns with the lines we already got. So that's why I'm going to the original, back out, and then that's how I'm like lining up the arm. And then we're gonna put in the division here for the trousers, AKA the legs, um, and then draw the hand after that. So yeah, the rest is kind of, you can pretty much just follow what I'm doing. Um, I don't feel like I'm gonna comment on every single part, every single thing I'm doing here. Um, so yeah, pretty much just follow what I'm doing. If I feel like I need to explain something, then I'll be back. So there you have it. That's pretty much how to draw the body. From here, you can draw whatever clothes you want to draw. I'm going to draw mine, so I'm going to speed this part up. I'm going to make the shirt kind of longer here and then just start drawing in my clothes. <laughs> Just a tip for like the shadows basically I think if you guys have been watching me for all this time you know how to do this at this point but for you guys that are new to the channel if you want to get like a good 3d look start with the base color get a color that's slightly darker and then decide which direction the lights coming in from on this case it's coming in like from the left and then use the darker color to put in shadows basically we about to blow us some mazza Bassa, get bassa From the block to Casa Blanca Get bassa, get bassa Watch me finesse with the jogga Get bassa, get bassa Habla mucho cala boca Tout est en flamme, j'adore quand c'est fuego Gotcha la rin, so they love it, my speed We run the world like we drug out bonito We fire them boots, so we soaring like eagles We are no eagles, you're more of a seagull I'm the one and only that Cool, so now we're moving on to drawing the head. To make this easier, you can draw a line through the middle from the body through to the top of the head. I don't normally do this, but I'm kind of just doing this to help you guys draw it, if you know what I mean. So for this character, while I'm drawing myself, I feel like I would be like a more oval head shape if I was in a Fairly Odd Parents. Um, so there's two head shapes in Fairly Odd Parents. There's this oval shape, which is like AJ's head shape. I think that's his name. Um, and then there's a standard Timmy Turner head shape, which is like the back is straight and the front is curved. So if you want to know how to do that one, go to my previous um, season, how to draw the characters. Um, but yeah, in this one, I'm showing you how to draw the oval head shape. So yeah, that's pretty much your basic shape. Next, you wanna put in the eyes. Again, I don't do this when I'm drawing them, but this is kinda of just to make it easier for you guys. So we, we put some guidelines here, and then we're gonna put two curves. Um, yeah, and I think this will make it so much easier for you guys. And then a line through the middle. You don't need this line, but if, you, if you're kinda of like small-eyed like me, you, yeah, <laughs> you know, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, if you've got like small eyes like me, then you can put that line to like emphasize that, you know what I mean? If you've got more round eyes, then you don't need that, just leave it. So for the eyebrows, you can, like I did here, just draw simple lines and then thicken them out. Um, use a ruler to make them straight. The funny thing in Fairly Odd Parents, the eyebrows are always sitting differently, like one's up here and then one's like, but you can do it however you want, that don't matter too much. 
Make sure both eyes line up at the bottom as well. Cool, and then the last thing for the head is the hairline. And then you guys can pretty much go from here, put in the hairstyle you want, um, add the facial features you want, if that's a beard or moustache, whatever it may be. So again, I'm gonna speed this part up and I'm just gonna add in all my uh, features. Listen, hey. Look, you number and name me, I pop like confetti and semis. I'm number one, like I'm heady. King of the Wizzy, I'm Shelly, I'm Shelly. I'm three steps ahead, like I made it in Eddie. Out of a deck, cheek, kick it like Jet Li. Jet ski wave, now I'm feeling like both me. Feel like a husky, I'm in a villa, like I'm in Mohesque. I don't do Britney, I don't do Becky. I do happy about the LA, LB. Man, I'm so different, we're not the same. The spread you distance, call me El Jefe. Call me the chief, but I don't do Juju, I don't do Voodoo. I roll with the king of the kings, roll with the spiritual chains. No demon time when I'm. So, as you guys know, um, I switch between a fine line and a bold marker. So, for the outside lines, I'd use more thicker lines. So I'd double up the line length with the marker. And then for the more detailed part, that's why I'm using a fine line. Blah no blah blah, no on the blah blah. Money to gang the line, and I sound no man in the dunya. I thank the Lord every day when I pray like hallelujah. So there you have it. How to draw fairly odd parents characters, season two. My season two. You dig? <laughs> so there you have it. How to draw fairly odd parents characters from season two of my draw rappers as cartoons. Um, yeah, if you like the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hopefully that was useful for you like the first one was. And yeah, I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye.